the Smithfield market in London has been an historical hub for meat trading since the Middle Ages. Just a short distance away, meat takes center stage in a place that has become a true institution. We are talking about St. John Restaurant, the pioneer of nose-to-tail eating. Founders Fergus Anderson and Trevor Gulliver opened this restaurant in 1994. Anderson explains that nose-to-tail eating means it will be disingenuous to the animal not to make the most of the whole beast. There is a set of delights, textural and flavorsome which lie behind the filet. Roast bone marrow is a must-try dish in this restaurant. It is served with a slice of homemade bread and a parsley salad. The marrow has a delicate, oily and very fatty taste that fills your mouth. With bread and parsley it becomes extremely delightful and surprising. Anthony Bourdain described it as a simple, austere, yet luxurious dish. The terrine, a composition of various parts of the animal following the nose to tail philosophy, embodies the essence of Saint John. Without decoration, simple as it is, it delivers sweet, bitter, creamy and rich flavors. However, St. John is not just about meat. In this restaurant, pairings are perfectly studied. This also happens with the sweet cake, a rutabaga cake, tiny sliced and layered, along with the lovely sweet salad and good curd. The beauty of St. John is that the cuisine seems simple and traditional, but it is also irreverent and unexpected. Lamb buffle with barley and aioli sauce, a dish that was divisive for us, very intense, with an extremely strong and wild flavor. In any case, the plate returned to the kitchen empty and clean. Ending on a sweet note, the Eccles cake a puff pastry filled with a currant mixture. It achieves a perfect balance between the savory of the Lancashire cheese, sweetness and acidity. The pairing is once again successful. St. John is not just a restaurant, it's an icon in the culinary world. It doesn't aim to please or convince you. It presents dishes in their truest form, inviting diners to explore flavors beyond their usual expectations. This place teaches you the pleasure of eating well, to the respect it has for the animal. 